Y'all listen, I don't mean in theory. I mean, the sky is gonna split. I'm telling you the trumpet is gonna sound. I'm telling you Jesus is coming back and when he returns, we're gonna have to look and when he returns, we're gonna have to look our savior in his eyes and give an account for what we did with this life that he entrusted to us. First, we're going to have to answer the question whether or not we were in relationship with God by placing faith in Jesus Christ. And then right after we seal that, the next thing will be was that the Lord will look at our lives to see whether or not the houses he entrusted to us are still standing whether or not we were faithful with the time, the talent, and the treasures that he gave us on this side of eternity. John says the reason why you want to make sure your house is still intact over time is because eternity is in view. And when eternity is constantly in our view, brothers and sisters, when we're reminded of the fact that one day Jesus is going to return, and by the way, I think that day is coming sooner than we think. He says, when you keep eternity in view, it changes the way you deal with the stuff of earth. The decisions that you make, the responses and reactions that you give to people, the words that you use, the steps that you take, the forward motion that you determine in your businesses and in your ministries and in your relationships with your spouses and with your children and your grandchildren. He says, you're going to want to build a house that is firm and solid and that stands over the course of time because you're going to have to give an account for this house of yours.